this is Michelle Marie and thank you so much for watching and joining me today for my little video. It's been forever since I filmed a video and I do apologize about that. If you guys follow me on IG, you know my life has been quite crazy and insane, but in so many good for so many good reasons. Um, so I haven't even planned that much or even journaled that much and I'm kind of missing it, but the busyness of life and also the tiredness um, that I've been feeling the last couple of weeks have really been digging in to me and just taking a toll on me, especially after working a long weekday. But that's neither here or there because I'm not here to complain or vent. I'm just here to show you a lovely flip through that I did of this beauty that I recently got. This is a Vander Speck Personal Wide Rings Planner. It is um, in the croc Croco, I think, Torto leather. Um, and it's kind of like a grayish color and it almost has, it depends on the lighting, almost has like a purple undertone. And then the pink inside, which I'll show you in a little bit, it's a Barbie pink. I know I'm saying it wrong, but I bought this secondhand from one of the local planner girls. Um, and typically I'm not into rings. However, I just saw this beauty and she, um, my friend wasn't feeling it too much and she wanted it to have a good home. And I said, well, you know what? I can give it a good home. I'll use it for the time being. I wanted to go ahead and downsize because I'm currently I was currently in a B6 traveler's notebook which I love the room to um to write in and everything, but it was getting way too heavy for me to carry um especially as an everyday carry. And I'm also thinking of the future in a couple months less than a year away, I'm going to be trotting a little one with me and I'm going to need a diaper bag. So I need something more compact. So I was thinking either personal or an A6 size. And I said, well, you know what? Let me try my hands on this beautiful personal white and see how it goes. Right now, it doesn't feel as heavy as my B6. And it's funny because a personal white to me looks like a B6, similar to a B6 size. So let's go ahead and get started. I do apologize if you hear any sighs or whining. My dog is in the room with me because she's... um wanting to be with mommy today. So I'm just letting you know for any noises, that's my disclaimer. Hopefully she'll behave good. So I have here this cute little Ollie clip in the front cause I just like my little Ollie clip there. And then I'm gonna go try to go, trying to keep this video 10 minutes or less because I wanna post it in my IGTV without the intro of course because I want my followers to go ahead and get a chance to see it. So I'm not gonna go into detail about all the shops that I have in here, but I will mention them quickly and then I'll tag them in a picture of uh, my video so you guys can go follow these shops. These are my favorite shops, which I love. So over here um, on this, on the ring planner, it has two side pockets here. I have a journal card and another journal card that my friend gave me and a postcard from Jane the Crazy on Instagram that she sent me. And then on here, I have some die cuts from some of my favorite shops. This, of course, is from Pookie Bear Cuties, my washi girl. I have here Haley, my uh, letter M from Haley Handmade Co. And of course, my cute little Luna Wizard. Where my Hufflepuffs at? Whoop, whoop. From, <laughs> from Shine Sticker Co. And then these beautiful fall clips that I got and these charms are from Very Sweet Plants. She is a doll and her clips are amazing. And then here I have my dashboards and uh, dividers are from Shelby Lico. And on my first dashboard, of course it's fall themed and I have one of my favorite verses which is which says, wait on the Lord, be of good courage and he shall strengthen through your heart, Psalm 27, 14. And it's been just, one of those verses that um has been stuck with me um throughout the last couple months with everything going on. So on the first one, I just have um of course my this was a little divider that Shelby had made for my pocket philo um philofax planner, and I just cut cut it down a little bit and put holes here. And this is of course my die cut from Miss Moss, and another die cut from um Haley Handmade Co. A cute little dashboard from Pookie Bear Cuties. And this is just a folder. Right now I'm just holding some of my favorite die cuts for now. I have, of course, my favorite pen in the whole world attached to this. And then 
I have split this up in monthly, weeks, um, a health one and a budget one. And I'm just warning you, some of the stuff is not filled out, but I wanted to show you at least my flip through so you can see what I've been working on. And I have, you're going to see this theme of the flamingos throughout is because um, if you're familiar with the 1407 planners, uh, the flamingo Fiona is their icon. And I got some die cuts because I became part of their VIP. It's called Flock with Fiona. And no, I didn't curse. <laughs> and I decided to use these die cuts for the um, dividers. These dividers, I got them from Little Lucky Planner. She makes really good, um, really good quality dividers and she has them in several colors and I wanted to keep kind of like the fall theme so I decided to do ivory um, cardstock and I just have September filled out I'm still getting used to the space because I write big so writing small is going to be my new year's resolution to write in my planners and then for the other divider I have the weeks and of course there's Miss Fiona again and this is what I I did this past week. Um, I did use a kit, fall kit from Pookie Bear Cuties. And it's actually one of her B6 kits. And it just fit perfectly in the way um, I want to lay out the planning and stuff. And she includes these dates. Let me see if I could put this up. I'm sorry. And she includes this with this kit. And of course, you guys know that I love doing my color coding. So I was able to use her B6 uh, kit throughout the week and I haven't done this week I'm just being real y'all I'll be sitting down either later tonight or tomorrow when I have some quiet time to do it and towards the last part I have um Shelby includes with her dashboard she includes a whole set with her dividers and she includes a bookmark and brave has been my word of the year for those of you that follow me you may already know that so I have this back here just as decoration my next area is health and this i really like this let me show you the layout of it when it's empty because it goes through symptom tracker and then how are you feeling and the meds and since my symptoms because of my pregnancy they change almost weekly not as bad as anymore as daily so i just like to track them and then of course the appointments of course i'm going to the doctors almost every other week i want to keep track of that so i really find this um this health tracker very helpful and then this is the budget tracker which i haven't done right the most important one and i haven't done it but just to show you it has an income with three columns and then bill and expenses with four columns and the quality of these um of the cardstock and the paper she uses is amazing and then this back one are just extra pages and what i plan on using with these i'm a post-it girl i love post-its and sometimes when you're on a call or you make an appointment and the doctor's calling you for lab results and you don't have time to go and run in your tracker I, I always have post-its anywhere so I can everywhere so I always I'm gonna put them over here and then I can transfer the information or even use this for list and then this is my other part of the divider and she also gives you another bookmark back here there's another pocket which I don't have anything and then this is one of my favorite um, bookmarks that one of my planner friends laminated and gave me from love Cynthia which she makes such adorable little girls and then of course my other pen that I keep there and then this is the pink that I was telling you about I believe it's a Barbie pink that's what they call it but I don't know the exact name like I said I'm not the original owner so and if you know it and you want to comment below with it please do oh and I almost forgot it has this awesome back pocket here which right now I have like a little dashboard let me show you a little dashboard with stickers that um gen xo plans made for me and then um a little postcard back here that i made with a die cut that i got and then a cute little bible verse some happy some freebies that i got from happy mail but what i plan on putting here in the back is the current kits that i'm using so if i have to plan on the go like i should be doing it'll be in there well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please put them down below. And as always, I really enjoy your support. Thank you so much.